Welcome to Bully Block Boxing. In boxing, they have a saying, somebody's got to be the bully. Uh, if you're new to the channel, go ahead, like, subscribe if you like the video, and don't forget to hit that notification button. All right, let's get into it. Uh, Caleb Plant versus David Benavidez. I think it's going to be an easy fight for Caleb Plant, easy fight. Uh, and I'll tell you why after we talk about the fighters for a little bit. Caleb Plant, sweet hands. He's slick. He's fast. Oh, yeah, I've also said, too, also, I don't know, in some of the comments, I know a lot of you boxing fans out there, you, you're on a lot of the same pages, that I think this is the Mayweather-Diego Corrales all over again replay. But can Plant pull off what Mayweather pulled off versus Corrales? That's, that's the question. So... Hey, LaPlante, sweet hands, he's slick, he's fast, he's got great footwork, great head movement, great counter, he's a counter puncher, uh, you know what I'm saying, he's not trying to get hit, he's not trying to take no damage, he's got good legs, good on the inside, good on the outside, and now we know he's got a little bit of pop to his punches because he just knocked out uh, Durrell. Uh, David Benavidez, David Benavidez, big he's tall he's strong he's lanky uh, he's got a lot of power he's got a lot of knockouts he's got fast hands he's good fighting on the inside he catch you on the outside and he's a monster you know, so that's why they call him the monster David Benavidez the monster so basically the reason why I think it was gonna be an easy fight for Caleb Plant is because if Caleb Plant just pops that jab, pops that jab, stays on his toes, stays on his toes, in, out, in, out. Just keep, man, he can box circles around Benavidez. The only thing is, can he do it all night? And if Benavidez catches up to him, you know what I'm saying, then he's going to have a problem. Also, too, what he can't do is he doesn't want to trade with Benavidez. If he gets if he gets cocky because he thinks because he thinks he's strong now because he just did that knockout. If he gets cocky and he tries to stand there and trade with Benavidez, he's going to be in for a long night. And he's going to be in trouble. He's going to get hurt. He might even get knocked out. So, like I said, easy fight for Caleb Plant. He stays on his toes, in, out, you know what I'm saying, counter, counter. If you don't stand there and trade, but to win, I got Benavidez. I just think that Benavidez is... He's a beast, he's strong, he's tough, he's a monster, he's in his prime, he's hungry, he's young, and there's a reason why Canelo don't want to fight Benavidez, you know what I'm saying? There's a reason why nobody wants to fight Benavidez, you know what I'm saying? Benavidez has power. I went to his fight, I went to his fight when he fought, um, the last fight that he just fought, uh, I don't remember the guy, but you could hear me in the audience, because right when he cracked him, I knew it. He, he was hurt, he was, you know what I'm saying, you could, visible signs. So I was screaming, go now, get him, get him. I'm screaming loud in the audience, loud, louder than everybody in there. It was quiet. I'm like, loud, get him. Right then, he got on him, attacked him. Boom, boom, boom. Knockout. You know what I'm saying? So I think easy fight for Plant. If he stays moving, it's a hard fight for Benavidez. Benavidez knows it's going to be a hard fight. He knows he's going to have to catch him. And he's going to be running just like Karen. And uh, Boots Ennis, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be the same shit. He's going to be running. He's going to be countering. But I just think that Benavidez is going to catch him, and he's going to hurt him. And once he catches him and he gets him hurt, he's going to take him out of there. I'd say probably about, probably the same, same, same as Canelo, like 10th, 11th round or something like that. Uh, question for you guys, if you want to leave a comment. Do you think Caleb Platt... Is gonna try to talk to Benavidez during the fight like he did Canelo. <laughs> oh man, that was just comical. So that being said, that's my prediction. That's that's my, my take on things. Um, go ahead and smash that like button. It's free, it don't cost nothing. Uh, shout out to all the boxing fans all over the world. It's my new channel, so bear with me. I'm not good at really talking on camera and stuff but you know what I'm saying I'm gonna give it my best shot try to join this boxing community and try to get some subscribers and you know what I'm saying just, just 
get get in the conversation. You know what I'm saying a little bit about me. I used to be a fighter. You know what I'm saying I boxed amateur and I boxed professional. We can get into that later. You know what I'm saying I got a lot of good sparring stories, a lot of good fighting stories. Uh, but the one time I, uh, yeah, we'll talk about that some other time. So that being said, I'm out.